Shut up. I just shut up. You're there doing. <laughs> like, your hair is just like. Oh my god. You showed me how you want to be so. Like, every good thing, sometimes, even like you saying, but or whatever, you go. Just come see me again. Like, I kind of want to do it with you. Like, boom. I had a miscarriage. I was like, eh? We stepping heavy if we rolling by the street. My circle almost empty, constant dealing with the beat. I'm just, I'm just good at counting, think it's pointless to agree. But I have to go and Hey guys, it's your boy Das aka Double Das aka the one and only. Yes, man, today I'm back with another ba -ba -ba banger, man, for you guys. And obviously, it was just like, you know what? I was gonna do this kind of like mellowed out, kind of like chill, but I was like, you know what? No, no, and no. You guys are gonna get exactly what you guys deserve, and that's just a banger, man, just for me. You know what I'm trying to say? But without further ado, let's just get straight into this, bro. It's a story time about how a girl tried to use a miscarriage just so that I would stay with her. Deep depth. There's so many different things. Maybe like a pregnancy scare, or maybe whatever it could be, like to use to, like, kind of like get somebody to just stay with you. But this girl tried to use a miscarriage. Deep depth. Deep depth. That, like, bro, the reason why I'm holding this mug today is because it's not holding tea. Anyway, without further ado, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I know you like this video, so don't forget to do it, please. And subscribe, come on, man. I can't keep doing this and keep giving you guys great content, and it's just like, no subscribing, no, no liking, no commenting. Like, what is this? And there's a link in my description for a reason to my Spotify. I'm going to be dropping something really, 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 really soon. So you guys really need to just keep, just keep at it. You keep saying something about the intro song. Mm -hmm. Let's get straight into this. So just like every single story that you talk about, obviously guy meets girl, all that kind of stuff. Obviously with me, it started on Instagram, innit? And obviously with me, it was kind of like, ah, uh, I saw this girl, like one of the reasons why I even moved to her was like, she wasn't really, I wouldn't even say a bit of my type, but she did music, innit? And a lot of girls really don't do music, like, obviously you have those ones that, you know, try rap and, hmm, hmm. And then obviously you got some girls that obviously sing, and she was a singer, innit? I saw her, like, on my explore or whatever, thinking, oh, right, this girl's nice, like, started talking to her, all that kind of stuff, and I was just like, cool, like, what kind of threw me up before I even started chatting to her, obviously? She had, like, let's just say a couple, like, tattoos. Yeah, I don't know, I played a lot of and I was just thinking to myself, like, me, I don't normally like tattoos because like, me, I'm not, oh, I haven't even got one on my body. Like, even for the tattoo brand, like, people from my family, we don't, we don't really like that kind of stuff in it. So, obviously, it kind of threw me off at first, but I was still like, you know what, this girl seems kind of nice, and she was like a bit of me. So, I was like, you know what, why not? Like, why not? Why not? So, obviously, through my DM, you know, cool it, talk, 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 you know, seemed like a calm person. So, I was like, you know what, cool, let's take this. To the road life, like, let's, let's go on a date. We went on our first date now, obviously, normal antics, butterflies in your stomach, barely kind of talking, a bit of awkwardness in the air, but with me, you see, I'm not really one of those awkward guys, like, I feel like if the vibe is there, the vibe will be there, like, whether you guys have just met, whether you guys have known each other for millions of years, but you guys are falling out, but then you haven't been speaking, and then by the time you guys meet each other, the vibe is there, so it's one of them ones that, when there's a vibe, you can't fake that shit, like, it's normal, it's real life, like, you can't, it's just it's not, it's not, it's nothing that you can, Teach, force, or fake, you know what I'm trying to say, like, it just happened. So, the vibe was there, innit? And obviously, you know, she had, like, the smile, she had the personality. Like, obviously, one thing for me as well is, like, when I first met you, like, obviously, clean. Like, you know, not, not saying that obviously she wasn't a clean girl or anything, like, come on, man, like, come on, man. Me, I don't go for all of that rubbish, but, yeah, so she was just, like, clean, drip-wise, you know, everything was just to a T on point. You know the ones where obviously after the first date you do the ha 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 smiley 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 and then you do the awkward leaning or or she might not lean or she might she might expect you to try and like make the first move. I kinda didn't like make the first move but we kinda got very close to each other and then I was just thinking what else do you think is gonna happen mate? So then obviously you land the peck. So obviously from there I just kinda thought you know like I'm actually gonna chat and chat to this girl like like properly so then you know when you first start like, speaking to a girl and then you're just like every single day like not every single day but every single possible time that you could have to yourself you're kind of like on the phone pew 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 into her if it's not key 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 laughing 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 then it'll be i don't know pillow talk and you guys are there from now to tomorrow morning so you guys have exams you guys have some you got work to do in the morning you've even got work normal work your mom is even telling you to shut up like you're even there just you're just annoying your mom shut up like just shut up you're there doing 
Like, your hair is just like, oh my god. And then, and then it's just like, really, like, really, like, at your big age, and then just smiling at your friend. All your friends even want to chat to you. They even, they even going through World War One, Two, Three. You're just there with that babe. Calm. That's what girls do as well, but that's another conversation for another day. Anyway, you know when you st like, continue to speak to a girl, you guys start to like have your casual like link ups in there. So obviously, we must have had like, let's just say another casual link up like after the first time in it. And you see, one thing about me is that I take like certain things. Like in a sense, like let's just say we're talking about something in theory, metaphorically speaking. So for example, I don't know, doing it in the bushes, for example. And then like, it's just like a metaphorical thing. Like, and I'm not saying that I run around and I start talking to girls and start saying, yo, like, yeah, nah, that. Bro, leave that shit over there. That shit be hot, like, no. I didn't do that. What I'm just trying to say is that, obviously, if let's just say you're in a situation where you're inside of your car and obviously she's in the past and she's just the two of you guys and you might have done a balloon or two, whatever, and um, you raised the like crew like, oh, like, there's a bit of tension there, but it's a, like, se like sexual tension, like, you know the ones where you really like this person and you've enjoyed their company so far, and then when you've linked up casually now, it's just the two of you, it's just like, wow, like, how can this get any better? So, cool, we linked up now, we was inside of our, my car, obviously did a balloon or two, and then what kind of, like, cir circulating inside of the air was, uh, it would be mad weird, like, mad funny if, like, I don't know, like, we were to, like, do it, like. And I was just there, like, you wanna do it, like? Yeah, you wanna do it? Like, I was thinking, like, this is the same girl that I have in my head that I'm thinking, no, like, like, she's making sense, like, she even does music with me, like, like we could even just, like, link up and, in, in a sense, like, my future, you know what I'm saying, that kind of vibe, yeah? And you're telling me doing it, and this is, like, maybe the second or third time that we ever linked up. I was just looking at you, like, bro, like, at the same time, obviously I'm a guy in it. Like, if let's just say you're offering to kind of like do it, obviously the right thing is obviously saying no. But if you're offering to do it, then <sighs> not like I can't have self-control. But I was younger then, so times are different. So cool. She kind of like, like insinuated that we did it. Like let's hop in the back, and I was just looking at it like, hmm, okay, okay, I guess. I guess we we could not Cause me, I wasn't trying to seem like I was stush. Like I'm not. You know what I'm trying to say like, but. At the same time that like, I just thought that you wouldn't be on that, but cool. So we hop in the back now. I don't know how easy to put this or say this, but we didn't go the way, but let's just say like she just did what I would have like she thought that I would have expected her to do. And then fell asleep in my lap. So I was just thinking to myself, this is very weird and I don't think me and this girl are gonna have a future with each other, like. And it's not even in the baddest of ways, but like I was saying before, like, you know when you built up that kind of thing in, like, in your head about this certain girl, and then she goes and does something that is like, why? Like, why did you need to do that? Like, why? Like, and then now you have me thinking or re reconsidering every single part of what I thought about you. Like, what was the need in that? That was selfish from you. In my head, that was selfish from you. Anyway, cool. I started to have my doubts, and I think she can kind of see that with like the way that I'm replying and all that kind of vibe. Like, and me, I'm not really one to hide that. Like, if any like anybody that knows me, I'm not one to hide my emotions in it. If I feel a type of way about something, like you're gonna know. Like whoever I'm around, whoever I'm with, whoever I'm talking to, like bro, I can't hide it because I feel like when you start hiding it and you start masking your emotions, you start having to deal with all of that that deep, like depressive kind of stuff, and that isn't it for me so obviously she started to notice that so i now was not like you know what i'm actually like like kind of tired of all of this like back and forth and all of this bickering and i kind of don't want to do this with you anymore like i'm i'm kind of done with it like i'm putting my hands up i said look please please you're watching me god now like me i'm trying to do the right thing go like i actually want to let you go like i don't even want you to be around me anymore like i feel like i'm as bad of an influence on you as you are on me like imagine and just so you guys understand yeah all of what i'm telling you happened within the frame of a month and what she was trying to basically tell me was that ah, uh, like uh, she was trying to like apologize and and trying to like say that ah, uh, she's never had somebody like me around her and she doesn't really know how to act and that like, she was basically making all kinds of like excuses under the moon because she started to see that i actually didn't care in it obviously me being me now i was not like fine like whatever and she kind of said to me look like if you're kind of pissed off or whatever just come back 
come see me again. Like, I kind of want to do with you. Like, me being a boy, thinking with, you know, down there. I was like, you know what, cool. But even at the same time, I was still thinking, I don't think I even want to be that serious though, like, especially with you because it's like, look at what's, look at what it's, it's in a sense coming to. Obviously now, we link up that day, then everything kind of happens, but don't worry, I use a gym. Like, I was not doing anything mad or anything crazy, like, I just made sure that, oh uh, yeah, that like, I was never, ever gonna do it like, like that, but she was trying to tell me that she only likes to do it or like, does things with guys that like, but without. I said, look, there's no, there's no way in this world I'm gonna now not do it. So obviously, we must have been doing it, doing it, doing it now, obviously, on our bus or whatever. Cool. Then after that, now she was not like, no, nah, like, let's go again, like. And I was just like, like I, I didn't even kind of want to, like, this was more or less for my satisfaction. Like, I wasn't even trying to do it, like, tug of war, kind of like wolves, kind of thing. I was like, no, it was, it was not gonna do that. Like, can I even my girl, like, we, we, uh, it's only my girl that kind of gets that kind of, you know, tug of war kind of treatment in it. So, as far as I'm concerned, mm -mm. so, that being said now, that actually being said now, we kind of went back to do it, but I remember very distinctively never like busting or nothing. Like, it was never going to be a thing where, you know, all right, cool, we can like think about, oh, okay, morning after, like all that kind of stuff. Like, no, 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 it was never going to be a that thing. Like, I remember distinctively not doing that. Remember that. What now happened was I get a message in it. She sends me a, a picture in it. After she sends me that picture, like, I was thinking it's like a tissue and like, a little bit of blood on it but then i was thinking like bearing in mind this was four days four days after that situation in it four days in it like cool so she sends me a picture of like a bit of blood on the tissue or whatever and i was just like okay like what's that meant to mean bearing in mind i'm eating my cereal everything da -da -da -da. then boom i had a miscarriage i was like eh i was like miscarriage Eh? For who? Eh? For for what? Eh? Like, I ha I was so, like, gone, like, I don't know if it's gunpowdered or gunpowder or just God-fearing or whatever you want to use to call it or describe it. I, I It's like a slap in the face. I was like, wait, wait, what? Every part of that cereal I threw on the ground. There was no way, like, absolutely no way way in the world because i was thinking i'm not no doctor or studies you know science or whatever I like but like i ran it past a couple of my female friends in that very moment like is that possible everyone was saying like no like the main cause of that kind of stuff like maybe it's like you know when you jeep like it's a bit too hard or whatever and you know maybe if you're whatever's not used to it then maybe it can start to like, like bleed or whatever but or like worse comes to you period and she was telling me no nah, like her periods come, everything. I was like, <clears throat> there is no way. <clears throat> sorry, there is, I said there is no way in this world that my first like child that is out there, that's still in heaven or wherever, was about to come from you. And I now lost them like that without a say, without anything like. And it was not like three or four days because at the very same time, these four days were of me basically trying to cut things off with her, so I can just say like, look, I don't really want to do this no more. I'm tired of it. You go your side. You you go. My, I'll go my side. She was like saying to me, "No, this is the case. Like, like, no, 100%. I had one. Like, I had a miscarriage or whatever." And I deeped it. When we first started speaking, one of the first things she mentions to me, which is which was what I found like a bit weird, yeah, was the fact that she said, "Ah, oh, like she's had one before, in it." Then I was thinking like. That's you and those other guys. Like me, and you, like that's not my portion. God forbid. Like, that's, not, that's none of that's nothing to do with me. Never. So I was thinking to myself, this girl is hundred percent just jazzing. So me trying to like better the situation, I just said, oh like maybe go for a run or like maybe watch TV to like I don't know soothe in your mood or whatever you think that that you can do to like get over like the situation. You know what she said to me? How can you think that? That's what I want to do. Like, is that all you've got to say? Like, I just told you something like this, and this is what you're telling me. Like, you're not even saying like, oh, you're gonna come and see me. Like, like oh, you're just so annoying. Like, oh, oh, I'm done with you. I was like, oh, you're done with me. Yeah, I'm done with you. Like, I don't want nothing to do with you. Like. Just go away. And then she started trying to like cry and everything. I was just like, like I looked at my phone and I was just thinking like, all in the space of maybe 10 or 20 minutes, like we've gone from me being shocked, then trying to reason with the situation 
and then boom, I'm the bad guy. Like, how did that happen within the space of like 10 minutes? Like, how? Like, how? So then, even at that point, yeah, I was not even like, you know what, maybe this is even a sign from God. Thank God that she was even the one that said to me, let's even just dead things, let's even just leave things. I was thinking to myself, all right, cool, like, calm, like, let's actually dead things off, like, like, cool, like, you, go about your business, like, me, I'll go about my business, that's fine. Couple hours later, I receive a text on my phone, like, oh, he's still dead. I don't even know why I didn't block her, but you see me, yeah, I don't really like blocking people, innit? Because the moment that you can block me, you're telling me that, look, you can be without me, you can do it without me, so me, you too, go. You know what I'm trying to say? Like, like I don't need to block anyone, innit? Maybe I can delete you, so I don't see your stuff, or whatever, but doesn't mean that I need to block you, innit? But her, ah, oh, yeah. Like, I overreacted. I said, mm 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 mm. Mm 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 mm. You showed me how you want to be. So, like, every good thing, sometimes, even like you saying, but or whatever, you go. Go. Just get out of here, man. Shit. Just get that. Like, because me, I was like, there was no way we was gonna now try and judge our way back into the situation like we'll just be there coming and we sit down like there was no way in the world we were gonna now sit down and just be like yeah let's just forget about what happened over there it's calm i'm better no no you're gonna go obviously the mo the moral of the matter of the story for me was that it was like you went from being black and it says not what I wanted, but I overlooked a couple of things for you in it. And obviously, the fact that I overlooked over, like overlooked a couple of things for you, we was talking, even though there were small, small hindrances here and there that, that you know, you did that maybe you didn't see that you did, and I and I was just still swallowing it. Then to now progress it to like the fact that you know, ah, uh, it's a whole miscarriage. I was like, from that, that is just taking the piss. Like that's just too, too far. Like. We haven't even been speaking for more than a month and you're doing this. Imagine now, yeah, and I'll get married to this girl. This girl is enough, yeah, to, I don't know, maybe fake killing her sister or, or, or maybe her sibling or something or I don't even know, killing one maybe of her friends or something and like maybe dumping the body in her house and blaming it on me. For what? Maybe not washing the plates. Like, that's how crazy I actually think that this, this girl was. So I was like, you know what? To save myself, to actually save myself, yeah, let me just pick myself out of the situation and be on my way and that's exactly what i did so more of the story is guys look not every single girl is going to be cut up to what they seem in it like sometimes you put on this facade of things like they might just overly like you and then they think oh they want to do things and this is even a bit of advice for girls that like, they want to like do things that you'd want or you'd expect them to do like they come out of their comfort zone for you but let me tell you guys something Life is not about doing stuff like that. If you're not cut like that or you're not built like that, don't come and change your shape for one guy because you think that's what he thinks. He moved to you for a reason. You guys explore your shit together. That's it. Explore your shit together. Wherever it goes, it goes. But don't find yourself trying to conform and change your stuff or change your style of way of, of thinking about how you think things are meant to be just because of one guy. Like It, do it doesn't make sense. Because what will not happen is you end up looking like the crazy one. He goes about his day and then you're the one that's up to your body count now. Over a situation where if you was just calm and you just took time with things, maybe stuff would have been, you know what I'm saying, better. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And if you want more time, story times like this, please just feel free to just let me know in it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Double dice. Ah. We stepping heavy if we rolling by the street My circle almost empty, constant dealing with the beat I'm just, I'm just good at counting, think it's pointless, this degree But I have to go and get it, get it, get it, get it, get it.